Hey. Welcome to Dude RV. Hey, I really appreciate you stopping by and you got here just in time. That's right, just in time for another virtual tour of a beautiful Texas State Park. I have been spending the last several days camped on Wright Patman Lake in East Texas, and today I find myself at Atlanta State Park. That's right, I've been here before, four years ago in the rain and cold. I have Little Red, the high-speed mobility scooter with a bigger battery pack. I have the GoPro Hero 9 with the Max Lens Mod, which gives you stabilization beyond compare. But best of all, I have you. So let's hop on Little Red and go see this beautiful Texas State Park. If you like trees, if you like the forest, you are going to love Love, I say love this scooter run. Get everything situated. All right. Looks like we're going to be stuck behind the big long travel trailer with the canoes that, that, or the kayaks that drag. They actually have a firewood bin here at the office. I wonder if he knows he's dragging his kayaks every little bump he, I was behind him coming up to the gate so we're gonna follow him we go down to Wilkins Creek first visit the boat ramp and then we'll cruise through two camping loops and then we will go see full service full connection sites this is actually the second time I've made this run today the batteries on the cordless mic set up and I don't know what's, what's up with that they, they just give up they show full charge and somewhere in the middle of that run they died that's all right I, I really like doing this so I'm happy to do it again we do have a hiking trail, the Arrowhead Trail, and according to one of the campground hosts, it's probably the best one, the scooter. We're coming up on a really big hill. We gotta do a little switch backing to get up that hill because it's pretty dang steep. But on the plus side, coming back down is really fun. You really can't tell how steep this gets, but this is a, this is a pretty intense grade. Almost there. Fortunately, this, this bigger battery pack gets us up the hills much more efficiently than the original. The OEM. All right now it's downhill for the most part. There's another nature trail. nature trail any kind of hiking trail here in the East Texas piney woods is they're kind of hard for little red to navigate because of the the roots and we'll be coming back to the Wilkins Creek loop we're gonna head all the way down to the boat ramp first I think I've already said that Yeah. 
welcome back to White Oak Ridge. so pretty there's no reason nothing for me to say I mean beautiful and green all right all right so for my boat ramp fans here's the boat ramp now that's not much of a boat ramp but it gets your boat in the water and if you're looking to rent some canoes, they actually have canoe rental at both boat ramps. Right along. Now up here on White Oak Ridge, there's a campground host who's been here for at least four years. I know because I recognize the RV, big toy hauler with a smart car. I thank him for his thank him for his dedication climb a little bit We got to get a run at the next hill. So that's the toy hauler. These are all 30 and electric. These are all back end sites, 30, 30 with water. I said that. This is the end of the road. So these would be some really good sites. Especially that one right there. Uh, what number is that? That is 52. So end of the road, no neighbors on the patio, 52. Moving on up, moving on down. Now, somebody I'm sure is going to post a comment that I need to slow down. If you want, you want a good look at the campsites, you need to jump over on uh, campgroundviews.com. Dude RV10 will get you a, a great discount. I'll put a link down in the description below. All right, let's go see White Oak Ridge. And then we get to fly down the hill. Stop sign, no stop sign. I ain't seen no stinking stop sign. I'm breaking the law, breaking the law. All right, end 
onto the camping loop. Now these are all 30 and water sites as well. Some pull throughs, some back ends. Now the dump station at Atlanta State Park is in a most unusual place. It's right there behind the bathroom shower facility. Big bump. There's a little class A. I don't see a, a, a car, so I guess they're towing their boat with the class A. There's our tail dragon bullet. All right, and that brings us to the end of this camping loop. We don't need no stinking stop signs. All right, now we go down the big hill. Strap in, because we're going to be flying. Do not try this at home. See that sign, that truck? He's, he's going down! Hold on! Man, those are so much fun. I love those hills. It is a beautiful day. It's the last day of June 2022. 4th of July weekend. This is the weekend. And if you want to get a campground, campsite in any campground on 4th of July weekend, you got to be Johnny on the spot or use Camp Nab. If you're not familiar with Camp Nab, that's a fantastic little tool. Super, super a great price. Very, very economical price for what they offer. What that tool does is it, it I, you put in the parameters of the campground you want to visit and the sites. But, you, but I wouldn't recommend doing that if you're trying to get a 4th of July campsite, uh, put in the, the dates, location, and that little search platform will continually ping 
the Texas State Park System or Recreation.gov until it finds a campsite. Until a, oh, until a reservation is canceled and then it sends you a notice. Tells you, you better hurry. There's a site available. All right, we're going to come back to the Knight's Bluff camping loops. But first, but wait, there's more. But first, we're going to visit the boat ramp for my boat ramp fans and the designated swimming area. get a look at the designated swim area which is this little bay down here it's not even close to being considered a beach and then we're gonna look at the boat ramp for my boat ramp fans now we can go see some more campsites coming on back up the hill Might be getting a little low on battery. That's all right. We're almost to the end of the run. through the little loop here first and foremost. Now these are 30 in water. And there's, there's a lot of pine tree roots in here, so you got I gotta go slow. But you want me to go slow anyway. The park hosts here do a fantastic job keeping things looking nice and clean and pretty. These are all full connection sites. 50 amp water and sewer. So you'll find more big coaches here than the other camping loops. day use area basketball swings there's water access down here I personally think that's a easier better place to access the water than over at the designated swim area but what do I know
this lake is a uh, favorite one of several East Texas lakes where during the winter you'll see a lot of Canadian pelicans I didn't even know pelicans migrated we have volleyball horseshoes and a group covered group dining place pavilion y'all enjoyed that little ride through Atlanta State Park on Wright Patman Lake. Thank you for coming along on that ride. If you're still with me at this point, I'd be most honored if you'd consider clicking on the subscribe button. And for those of you who have been following along, that, that's why I do what I do. That's why I am here. Thank you. How cool is that? I mean, how beautiful. And for my patrons, I am most grateful. Thank you. You rock. All right, y'all come back now, you hear? <laughs>